hey guys welcome back to ocean beauty in this video i will be trying to transform myself into like the euphoria aesthetic like in no way am i trying to like romanticize the show or anything i just really enjoy like the outfits and the makeup that they wear on the show but i kind of tweaked that into like a cute valentine's day look that's why you see like the backdrop in the background but you'll see like my outfit and everything that goes with it at the end of the video but first i'm gonna start off by just filling in my brows um i have not done like makeup makeup in a long time so i don't even have like all the correct tools for this and it's not like a tutorial like i'm just showing you guys like a creative look so please do not judge me if i'm using the wrong materials or i'm not like doing something right but i just dug out my really old pomade um i think it was some brow pomade from anastasia i think um, I don't have it by me right now, but I'm pretty sure like any brow pomade will be good for this. And then you probably don't even have to like fill in your brows because sometimes in the show they wouldn't like, well, I couldn't tell if they would do their brows or not, but it would look like they would mostly just do glitter makeup or glitter eyeshadow or something. But after that, I'm just going to go through and like clean up my brows and make it look kind of sharper. Once again, I am not a pro at this, so yeah, I don't know if I'm doing this right anymore. It's been so long since I've dug into my makeup. Like, I took a year break from it, and I just felt like I was just in a creative mood, and I really liked the aesthetics of the show, so I wanted to try this out. And now I'm just cleaning up the top part of the brows. I just wanted to make sure like it was sharp and straight because I like I used to have trouble doing brows like it would actually look like blurry like when I used to do them and now I'm going to the other side it's actually easier because I had already gotten my brows waxed like usually I would go and get it waxed like every three weeks or whenever it grows like back out of line or something so it actually helps like to keep it straight because if I didn't, like, it would probably look like a wiggly worm or something. I don't know. But, yeah. I'm just doing the same thing to the other side. But I did use less of the um, concealer under it this time. Just so it's not, like, hard to blend in. And now we're about to go to the top part for the second brow. I really like this shade like it is a bit lighter but like when I blend it out like it's my skin tone so it's easy to work with. And in this video I wanted to mention a really good podcast called A Black Girl Series by my friend Benedette. I highly recommend this podcast for the young black women out there. Oh, this is the eyeshadow that I'm using. Um, I just used some like pink sparkly eyeshadow from them because it's going to go with the Valentine's Day aesthetic. But back to the podcast, like as you can see, it says play again because I listen to this all the time. Like I'm always there when a new episode is dropping. It's just the aesthetic, the vibe. Like it gives such a homey and like relatable feel, which I love about this podcast. So I don't know what you're doing, but you need to go tune in. And if you're not like, what are you doing with your life? Go tune in. But back to the look. Um, I did like the basic pink sparkly eyeshadow and then I also had some like separate glitter up there it's like really sticky and not gonna lie it was hard to get off I'm pretty sure any glitter is but yeah and then I didn't have any lashes but this mascara it's just drugstore mascara like it usually does the trick and this is like what I would use like from a day-to-day -day basis and this is pretty much like the final look with the makeup um I blended it in like really good and I also used some highlighter and I absolutely love highlighter. It just gives you this glowy look and I feel like my fro tied the aesthetic together. Like I just 
took my puff down and picked it out like off screen but i really feel like it tied the look together and i had like this sparkly lip gloss that i had gotten from bath and body works and this really 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 cute pink dress that i got from rainbow for like what 11 12 dollars and it's an extra small and i just turned the camera like in a kind of weird way but i just want to give you guys like the full vibe and like the full image like i love this dress usually like my favorite colors are like yellow and orange but now i'm really feeling like green and pink and brown but thank you guys so much for watching please do not forget to like comment share and subscribe bye